In this episode we see, Sanjay's confession causes a scandal at the school. So he leads the battalion of outraged parents demanding Sanjay's expulsion as well as a re-evaluation of his previous performances. Chi Yal sends Dong He for a meeting and in his absence, goes to investigate his room, where he finds all of his photographs and the pen that he once used to have and had given to Su Hai Yin. He also finds Su Hai Yin's diary and finally connects the dots. Meanwhile, the detectives carry on their investigations and figure out that Dong He is Zhang Song Hai Yin. Chi Yal later learns that Dong He didn't make it to the meeting, he's gone to the hospital where Hai, as he had learned, is recovering. Before Dong He can choke Hai Yi to death, Heng Sun arrives and pushes him back, only to invite his fury but before he can attack her with a vase, Chi Yal arrives and knocks him down. The star teacher then gives chase to his manager to run up the stairs and stops at the terrace. Chi Yal asks him why he's doing this, to which Dong He replies with anger and frustration, telling him that he's the only adult he could trust and wish to protect. Chi Yal helps him realize a bit that his selfish and guilt-free murders have to stop. However, the way that Dong He can bring all of his actions to a close is by committing suicide, which he does, even with Chi Yal's repeated efforts at preventing and discouraging him from doing so. Hai Yi finally becomes conscious and is not fond to find her overtly zealous and animated biological mother. Meanwhile, her friends Dan Ji and Jian who visit and check up on her. Sunjay drops out of school. He later visits Hai Yi and gives her the hairband that he had bought for her. Later, he confesses that he's had a crush on her for a long time, asking her out on a date, only to be rejected, at least until Hai Yi finishes her CSAT. So he has already started to lose the prominence she used to have among her group of moms when she and everyone with her finds So he's husband having the time of his life while on a date with his affair. So he rages out and beats her husband, and the video goes viral in no time. Meanwhile, Heng Jae continues to be shameless as she begins lusting after Chi Yal's money, even asking him for a car. Later, she calls him to ask for cash when Hai Yi arrives and takes her phone away, warning her that if she continues to behave this way and ruin Heng Sun's relationship with Chi Yal, she'll kill herself. Destroyed by what she witnesses in the form of her mother, she cries her heart out, when Sanjay calls her and later the two meet at their usual hanging spot. She shares how she's so devastated at the state of her mother, who she'd always had these fantasies and imagined scenarios with. She hates that her mother is here and now she can't even imagine her biological mom being a good person. Sanjay consoles her and tells her that they don't get to choose their parents, that they can only try to become better than them. The episode 15 ends with the family throwing a birthday party for Hai Yi, who wishes for her aunt and uncle to be happy forever. When she reveals it to everyone, they are confused. Hai Yi explains further, telling them all that she has decided to go to Japan with her mother. That's all in this episode. Thanks for watching.